I need to know how to fix iPhone disabled connect to iTunes. The iPhone gets locked after 6 failed attempts to enter the passcode, I think. After that, you get the iPhone is disabled connect to iTunes error. The hard part is that you can't bypass the iPhone disabled error because of security. If you have iTunes in sync, you can connect to a computer with iTunes installed and do a restore from the iTunes on the computer. So I have no options if I haven't synced the phone with iTunes. No, if you don't have iTunes on it or don't have working iTunes, connect the iPhone to a computer with iTunes. iTunes will tell you that the passcode isn't working or passcode isn't in sync. Disconnect the iPhone from the computer. Then hold down the sleep-wake button so the slider comes up and turn off the iPhone. I can do that without being connected to the computer. Connect a USB cable to the phone but don't plug that end into the computer. Launch iTunes on the computer. Push and hold the home button on the iPhone, and then connect the iPhone to the computer. So that's why you wanted the cable in just one end, so I could plug it in at the right time one-handed. Keep holding home as you connect the iPhone to the computer. It will try to recognize the device and should pop up the connect to iTunes message on the phone. Do I keep holding down the home button? When you see connect to iTunes on the phone, let go. And it should say it detects the iPhone in recovery mode. Do you want to restore it? But I may have had iTunes Sync enabled. If that's the case, connecting the iPhone to the computer and launching iTunes causes it to connect to the phone. And it shouldn't ask for a passcode so it doesn't matter if you forgot the password. What do I do to fix the phone when the computer's iTunes recognize it? First, back it up. Second, restore backup. That seems redundant. First, backing up ensures that if the iOS on the phone is hosed, you have a backup of everything, and if you've never backed up the device, you cannot back up the device when locked, though you can log into iCloud to see if it has done backups. So if I get this error on a new iPhone and never backed it up, I need the geniuses at the Apple Store. If it is a new phone, they'll understand why you got the error and help you fix it, though with a new phone you won't lose anything but self-eyes of yourself with the new phone. Second point. Doing the backup and then restoring it will unlock it. So that bypasses the iPhone disabled connect to iTunes error. And then, if you have to, change the passcode or get Apple support to do that. At least now I have a few ways to try to get it working.